We're here at Mission Hill Family Estate, controversial place owned by Anthony von Mandel, one of the biggest businessmen in BC. Made a fortune selling lemonade, Mike's Hard Lemonade, and with it spent 60 million bucks building what's basically an architectural wonder, Chagall Tapestries Underground Cellars. Love it or hate it, it is quite something, it's very impressive. Now Mission Hill, they're well regarded for producing some of the top wines in the Okanagan, such as Oculus or Perpetua, their signature Chardonnay. But they're also well known for producing very average everyday drinking table wine, such as a, a Painted Turtle and a, a, a Sonoran Ranch sold in big jugs that is brought up from other countries like the United States, imported into bulk here in BC and then bottled and sold as product of Canada. A uh, little bit dodgy if you ask me. But anyway, Mission Hill own about 2,000 acres of vineyard and they employ some top-notch people like Misha Roland, one of the leading winemaking consultants in the world, 100,000 bucks a day. Big dough, big dough on the consulting winemaker. Um, but uh, they do get some good results and uh, I'm particularly passionate about their Chardonnay, which back in 1992, they won a special award for world's best Chardonnay at the International Wine Spirit Competition. So that's what we're here to check out and that's why Mission Hill is in the top 10 wineries of the Okanagan Valley. This is a big deal. This is Mission Hill's Avery Trophy for winning the best Chardonnay worldwide at the International Wine Spirit Competition. When the results were released, everybody just about fell off their bar stool. They're so shocked. But actually, you know what? Mission Hill does have a talent at making Chardonnay, and that comes from John Symes and the oak he uses and the vineyard sources he draws from, and just his general touch with Chardonnay. He does do a good one. Mission Hill have the most amazing collection of old antique drinking vessels. Some of these come from the second or third century and Von Mandel's made a real spectacular collection uh, drawing from Roman and Greek times. It's uh, something pretty special to see. Mission Hill is well worth a visit. It's certainly the most architecturally stunning winery in the valley, and Anthony von Mandel, well, he's hell-bent on establishing an international reputation for the winery.